early morning i be in a rush so i don't get time to record too much of anything and that's my warm water mug so that my warm water is ready hello everyone welcome to my channel and i am going to prepare something special for today this recipe is shami kebab chicken shami kebab and i'm going to show you the recipe from the starting so here i'm cooking the onion here i added other lesson paste keep cooking the onion till it's golden brown now i'm adding haldi red chili powder kanda lesson masala here i'm adding one big spoon of zeera one elaichi and little badi soap i'm adding one spoon of salt to so mix it nicely i'll add half glass of water so here here i added half glass of water take the side bowl and add it to the onion 500 grams of chicken keema so here i have added the chicken keema and i'm going to mix it nicely but i'm going to add one spoon of garam masala added bay leaves and cinnamon and now i'm going to cook, close the cook till the batter is cooked and cooled down i'll make some watermelon juice so i'm straining out the watermelon juice watermelon juice is ready I remove the chicken from the cooker. After cooling down, I put it in the grind. Here I'm adding kothmir and pudina in the batter. One green chili. I'll cut it half. I added one egg. So let's start grinding. So there, the batter is ready. So there, my batter is ready. Now I'm going to mix the batter nicely. So here my chapati is ready and kept in casserole and I'm making this cheese. I've kept it ready because I'm going to make shami kebab with cheese burst. Let's show you how. I started frying the shami kebab, putting one at a time. Mix at a time on slow gas and every shami kebab has a cheese block here. More shami kebab is getting ready. I remove two. There it is, my shami kebab with cheese burst. so i cut it to show the cheese that's oozing out from the kebab so this is the plating of my shami kebab paratha and cucumber i served it with salad hope you liked my recipe please leave a comment in the comment box and let me know if you liked my recipe i had gone out for some work so that's my all time favorite bhel and pani puri i could not resist it and finally i ended up making some detox water with the peppermint ginger and lime i made it in 1 liter water i boiled it till it reduced to half and uh, that's my preparation for the detox it's simple you can sip on it throughout the day so here it is reduced to half and uh, once it's cooled down i'll put it in the bottle and i'll sip on it that's it for today i'm going to end my vlog over here till then take care and see you in my next vlog bye